Hey guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be trying this. I'm using the Light Bronze Jergens Instant Sun Natural Glow. I'm also going to be doing something stupid because it says on it not to use on your face. But I don't want to be a Noompa Loompa from here down. And then right here not be one if, you know, it turns me orange. So we're going to put a little bit on our face because I didn't get the face one. Because for one, that's a lot of money. To, you know, spend on tanning myself. And two, my child was screaming in the middle of the store, so. But yeah, so I will give a review on how this looks. You can see I'm very pale. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, guys. So I just got done cleaning myself up and exfoliating with um, my brand new loofah. Um... It's right there. It's like some type of plant, but um, it's crazy looking, but it's really good at exfoliating. So I exfoliated my whole body, including my face, and I'm letting that dry up a bit. And then I'm going to add moisturizer to my face and my whole entire body before I tan. So, okay guys, so I just completely moisturized my whole entire body. Um, since I did my legs first, I'm going to do that first now because the moisturizer has set and dried so I'm gonna do that and show you guys the difference okay guys so so far it's made me a pretty good color it's not too too dark um it's really hard to be able to tell on camera because you know, but in spots you can see but um I'm a lot tanner when I'm looking at myself in the mirror than I am on camera. <laughs> okay, so guys, this is how it turned out. And this is my baby boy. And it's pretty dark for me. Being as pale as I am, it's pretty tan. I used a tiny bit on my face, so it matched, and it turned out really well, actually, so. Compared to my actual skin tone, you can see with my hairline. Probably in better lighting, you will. I'm watching Cat in the Hat, by the way, but, um, yeah. This is not bad at all. I like it, um. You can put it on at night time and then just let it progress as you sleep. And it turns out really nicely. So if you have like an event to go to, um, like in, a, in the morning and stuff like that, and you uh, just put it on at night and you're like, I want to look really good, then put it on at night before you go to bed um before I put it on I shaved my whole entire body and I cleaned myself really well and exfoliated um and then moisturized after all that and whenever I, my body was completely like set in with the moisturizer and everything then I then I put on the tanner but like it worked really well like, I have never seen, it, it, it's a good tanner, it is very good tanner, so if you are looking for, um, one that's, like, cheaper, it's, like, around 11 bucks and all that, um, I applied it with just my hand, I would advise getting a mitt, because my hand's orange, but, um, I'm gonna try to remove that, so. The baby boy, he's literally trying to pip on me, so I'm gonna go. But yeah, that's my review. I like it very much. I'll probably do another shot in the lighting. So, okay, so as you can see, I am darker than I was. My face isn't as dark, mostly because I put like a light dust of the tanner on, but it, like. It's darker, so it also makes my hair look lighter than it actually is, too. So, it's a win-win for me. Um, I did manage 
to, as you can see, miss my whole entire hand. And around my nails are just nasty looking. But other than that, it looks good and it's pretty even. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.